Hi, my name is Jeff Lytle, and this is a short video on how I created an ion or radiation detector from a adrenal microcontroller and a modified smoke detector circuit board. So you can see here I've added a few jumper wires to the bottom of the smoke detector circuitry. There's just two jumper wires going off pin 1 and 2 of the MOSFET. When our 9 volt battery is on, it feeds electricity into these two plates. We have a negatively charged plate and a positively charged plate. When the ions created by the americium enter between these two plates, they create a small voltage which is read by this chip here, which is a MOSFET. Notice, uh, notice the voltage here. It's at a negative 0.32 volts. Our LED is off. I'm going to pick up the americium 241 and as I hold it closer to the detector the voltage will jump up and our light will begin to blink brighter the closer I get. As I pull away the voltage drops. It seems to take a few seconds for it to drop back down to zero. I'm not sure why. So let's see that again. I'll bring it in quickly this time, in and out, so you can see the voltage go up and drop really quickly. This is an example of the code running on the microcontroller. It's just a few lines of code mapping the values output by the MOSFET two different values to light the LED at different brightnesses. Now let's see how all these things work together in a complete system. <clears throat> this is our alpha source, americium-241. Alpha particles shoot off the radioactive americium and hit ion, or hit molecules in the air and break them into positively and negatively charged ions. The ions are then attracted to the positive and negatively charged plates in our detector. The detector is, plates are being charged by this voltage here. When the ions hit the positive or negatively charged plate, it creates a small voltage which can be detected by our MOSFET. The MOSFET can detect very small voltages, almost a billionth of a volt. This small voltage is then biased and create a larger voltage which then goes into our AVR microcontroller which maps the different voltages that are sent to the MOSFET to different values lighting this LED. The LED becomes brighter the more ions in between these two plates. If the emery seam is taken away, less ions will be in between these two plates and our light will go off. I do plan on adding more to this design to see how accurate I can get it. But that's all for now. Thank you for watching my video.